So welcome to the historic Hotel Del Coronado, 1888. Although, looks like, again, you can see from the outside. I'm not sure uh, what's going to be like. This is kind of a whole layout of the whole map. And they've got uh, new areas going on. Spring 2025. So it's really going to be much nicer than it is all now. It is now. I mean, it's super nice now. It's going to even be double nice after we get done with it. I mean, old places you have to take care of. But uh, we'll go around the front and uh, see what it looks like. If you really want to see without all the construction, I do have a video. A few of them. I'll put it in the link below. Because uh, you you'll see the true beauty of this uh, beautiful, historic, Victorian hotel that has a ton of history in it. So, obviously, I will have to do another good Hotel Dell video coming up in the spring. Probably when I come back from my second Southeast Asia travel adventure. So, I'll be looking forward to that. But it looks like they have it opened. I mean, why would they close it? I mean, they're losing a lot of money if they close it. But hotels, they generally do this. They go through big renovations. See it happening all the time over in Asia. Just part of the park. So I'm at the lobby area, and it looks like at least they don't have all the renovation going on on this side because this is actually the prettiest side of the hotel but just look at that it's just so beautiful and you can see that the windows that are open there you know they're going through that process but starting room i would say around 300 a night at the budget level I think there is one haunted room here. It's got a little history in it. But uh, let's go inside and uh, take a look. I'll give you a good outside tour of the uh, lobby area as soon as you arrive from your chauffeur or car or Uber, however you get here. This is where you're gonna first come. Gonna drop your car off, and I gotta check this. Show you this uh, really cool porch, which is uh, one of my favorite places. But look at the stained glass windows of this place. You don't get uh, too much of that. That's one thing um, about. Victorians is the uh, stained glass window and look at this uh, front porch and look at these windows once again you really don't see too many of these because they don't make them for homes anymore and these have been obviously renovated but still very beautiful at that you can come over here and uh, sit on the rocking chair So you gotta love these uh, little rocking chairs right here. So you can sit here at the Dell, I and mean, you don't even have to be a a visit. You just be a visitor and just come here and hang out, and read a book. I mean, who's gonna tell you to leave? I mean, look at this. Okay, this is Historic Hotels of America, and it is a National Historic Landmark built in 1888. So let's say we uh, go inside and uh, check it out, shall we? And just before we go in, this is a little construction began in 1887. Completed 11 months, amazing feat. And they started arriving around the end of January of 88. So you can see how 
quick they got this place up and how neat it's that. Give you a slow, look at this awesome chandelier coming up. Wow, I have to say wow a lot. I don't know how many times I've been in here, but it just never seems to be enough. And again, this is the uh, reception, and they even have the original key holders up there. You can see, although they don't use room keys, you know, for security-wise, that just kind of shows you the character of this uh, hotel. And what's nice about this hotel is I'm going to show you some pictures of some famous folks that have passed through this place. I think like Marilyn Monroe and has been through here. Well, these beauties. That shot. Look at these gals, they are some. That's gotta be one of the originals, just by looking at it. Maybe uh, late 1800s. Queen hmm. 30s, late 30s, 40-ish maybe, on um, that one. Oh, look at this one coming up. Ooh. Looks like they have, uh, you cannot go here. This is the uh, really cool courtyard. But uh, what I'll do is uh, I'll put a link below on my last tour of the Dell and you can see inside this really cool courtyard. It is really something. Actually, the last time I was here is when they had the uh, ice skating rink, uh, which won't, won't be here this time. But uh, they do put that up around uh, December. So we're gonna go downstairs and uh, check out below. And this actually brings you out to the beach and boardwalk. Let's go down this way. Now below, it is, uh, has a little bunch of uh, shops you can uh, enjoy. But again, look at these uh, pictures. That's, a, that's Bay Boat, by the way. Good old babe. So they got some really neat photos here. And here you are. You got a nice little sandwich shop, little you can sit and enjoy. Let's go up there and uh, check the uh, check this restaurant out and go I'll check the uh, the beach scene this is what it looks like here and there is a little kind of restaurant bar right here on the beach how nice is this and a quick walk through got that nice Victorian background to it and just kind of circle around really cool looking picture just look at that. it just tells you the history of this place right away look at this thing another really neat shot The Gray Marlin at Hotel Bell. So look at this. You go from inside dining to outside, and you got the ocean right out there. But before I head to the uh, boardwalk, now actually over here, I'll point it out before. After I go check out the uh, top deck, you'll see the swimming pool. Oh, this is such a loads of fun. Oh, 
like I'll point it out right now. They actually, where this green is, they make that into a uh, ice rink uh, during the uh, winter months. How neat is that? And you can see that in my video on what they do. See all the uh, renovation. But at least they, they have the main historic part of it not covered up because that's the coolest part which is actually right there cool. how's that for a beauty poolside dining I've never stayed here Of all the years that I've passed this on the beach, I've never stayed. I've been through here numerous times. But, uh, I've always, like, thought of the idea of spending a couple nights here, but I just haven't done it yet. Maybe I'll do it now. Look at this awesome dining. To rent something like this, it'll uh, the minimum spend is $175 to sit out here. And the best time is obviously in the evening, and they'll light the little fire for you. And you can go further down, more dining. Let's go uh, check out the. Uh, this is the boardwalk right in front of the Dell. 